Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my graphic design channel. And today I'm going to show you how you can create 3D stake in Adobe Illustrator using only this flat illustration. And of course I'm going to show you how you can create this smoke. And if you're interested, then keep watching. Now you see the size of my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial and if you want to take a closer look at the design and to download an original vector file with colors and my design, you can do it on my Patreon page, the link will be below this tutorial. And guys, if you want to start sell your designs online, for example on Adobe Stock or Shutterstock, when I invite you to meet with my new book, 50 Easy Ideas, it's a book for a beginner designers who wants to start sell their designs online, as I already said. And if you want to know more about my book, you can go below the tutorial and you will find the link on my book below the tutorial. And as well, here you can find video instruction about my book and my 10,000 portfolio on Adobe Stock. Well guys, hope your workspace is ready and colors are already in the swatches panel. Let's take that color and ellipse tool and create the ellipse with these options. Okay, move here. Now create one more ellipse with that options. Okay, move here. And now let's take rectangle tool and create the rectangle with that size. Okay. Now let's move our shapes like that. Select the rectangle, take free transform tool and that option. Perspective distort. And select this point and make like this. Now let's move that shape a little up. Select all three shapes, move here, you can align them and select again and Pathfinder and Unite. Now let's take Smooth tool and smooth these corners. Direct selection tool and just play with this point, move here and this point a little up and here to make unperfect view of our stake. Now let's take smooth tool to smooth a little the shape. Okay. Now let's take that color and ellipse tool. Create here the ellipse. Like that. Make it a little longer. Okay. Copy and paste it, make smaller and take red color. Now let's take direct selection tool and play with the points. And here the same. To make more unperfect and more realistic view. Now we need red color and brush tool. Here that option in the brush tool, OK. And let's draw with help of brush tool uh, different shapes uh, to create the view of the stake. I can create the shapes I like and you can create the shapes you like. So let's if you need to smooth something, you can smooth it with the help of smooth tool. And let's continue to draw.
You can take, for example, a photo of uh, the real stake and create the shapes uh, looking at the photo of the real stake. Okay guys, my shapes are ready and now uh, let's select these ellipses and group them and move in them here for a while. Now go to Windows and 3D and Materials and now select the light shape of the stake, go to Object Path, Offset Path and here 10. Okay, and take red color. And now let's take direct selection tool and play a little with uh, the new shape to make a more unperfect view, like that. Now select the stick and group it, it's very important. And go to 3D and materials and go with me here step by step. to create 3D stake. As I already said uh, many times in my 3D tutorials, uh, there is no one rule to create a 3D illustration. You need always play with the options uh, till you like the result. So here you need to go with me step by step or you can try to use your own options. Maybe your steak will look better than mine. Okay, it's ready. Now let's select that shape, but at first bring it to front, put here and again to 3D and materials and step by step with me. Okay guys, it's ready. Now let's create the background. Uh, let's take green color and rectangle tool, create the square and send it to back. You can stay it like that or you can create uh, the gradient background. Let's uh, select the background. Uh, radial gradient, move here the green color and here the yellow, play with the slider like that. Ok, you can make the gradient smaller and our stick is shining. 
you can create uh, close the window 3d and materials and uh, if your stake is ready select it and go to object expand appearance group it and now you can change the size of your stake now let's create the smoke we need black classical color with color code six zeros and white classical co color with color code six f and now let's take black color and rectangle tool create the rectangle like that object create gradient mesh and let it be five three here and that's it now we need to take mesh tool here and you need to add one more line here you can block their background uh, and let's take mesh tool and add here one more line and now direct selection tool select these points and move them to the right and one more time select these points and move them to the right okay now let's play with the points a little i'm going to show you one shape and after my example you can create your own shapes of the smoke okay like that now let's um, move these points the same here and the same here to make them a little unperfect and now let's take white color and add it straight in the points in the middle okay like that uh -huh, let's move a little closer like that okay it's okay okay that uh, now it's not unperfect let's uh, make it smaller like this move here and the main here is opacity screen okay and now you need to play with the points and to add or delete black or white color to create a more realistic smoke you view uh, you can take their photo of the real smoke and uh, look at the photo to understand how the smoke uh, must look like and you can always add more uh, strokes and rows with help of a mesh tool so you can play with their points as many time as you want to make more uh, better and better smoke I'm going to show uh, how to work here on one shape and after that you can create more different rectangles shapes smokes to make your own smoke so as you see i add all the time all stroke or row to make my work easier and make more realistic view of the smoke okay uh, 
let's continue to work uh, now guys uh, you can make it smaller and the main here as well transparency let it be 50 or 30 and now let's uh, play again with that shape let's copy it and now you can for example rotate it add a more white color add less white color um, add more black color uh, change the transparency to create more realistic view so like that okay guys uh, our steak is ready hope you like my tutorial if yes give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator or in the next videos about a graphic design bye bye guys Mwah.